Welcome back to Pokemon Sun. Last time we had technical difficulties. This time, before you attempt your trial, you'll probably want to get ready in Paniola one last time. But where do you get ready for Route 4 so you can make your make it all the way to Paniola Town? Hey, I remember these people. Stop right there. <laughs> we didn't mean to surprise you. You must be doing your island challenge. It's Dexio and Cena. Beautiful name for a beautiful lady. We're here seeing the sights in Alola. It's a unique tr tradition of island challenge. It's pretty fascinating, I gotta say. Oh, I got an idea. You and Dexio should battle. And why should we do that? I thought I might as well test my skills. Is that alright with you? <clears throat> if you'd ever like to battle, in, I will be willing. Just ask. Sure. <laughs> Mmm, that Cena and Dexia smell like a challenge. You can just feel the power coming off of them. I think I'm gonna go ahead and put... Stanley in the front. Alright, let's go ahead and battle. Then I'll let my partners go wild. This is the first and only t this is the first time we've actually gotten to battle Dexio. We- you do not get to battle Cena or Dexio at all in X and Y. Those to show how involved they were. <laughs> Let's go for a charge. As it goes for a water gun. Now we go for a Thundershock. Let's go for another Thundershock. Alright. Stanley grew to level 20. And here it is, Espeon. His final Pokemon. I'll go ahead and use Gear Grind. The plus one special defense and resistance to Psychic are both very useful here. Let's see. Gear Grind is looking like a two hit KO. to take another confusion of course. And then and then we should gear grind it one more time for the KO. Jawbreaker 2 grew to level 13. Haymaker grew to level 18. And Dexia was defeated. Alola trainers have a different charm than those in Kalos. Go ahead and have a blue Pokebuff. Alright. That's what I would expect from a trainer doing the Island Challenge. I felt the bond between you and your Pokemon. I feel like I've been able to have a glimpse of the island challenge. Let me heal your Pokemon as things. You and your Pokemon are the ultimate team, no doubt about it. This battle reminded me of us in the past, and that group of five young trainers. I've made up my mind. I'll entrust this important item to you. The Zygarde Cube. It just casually gets a name drop like that. The item that I just gave you is for collecting the cores and cells of a Pokemon, Zygarde. I'll tell you the details another time, so please keep it safe for now. For your island challenge, it might not be a bad idea to go to Route 4 to train your Pokemon. We'll be taking our leave now. Bon voyage! There's a town up Route 4 we've never seen. Nothing gets me fired up like a new destination. Alright then, um... 
I think for now I'll go ahead and put Jawbreaker 2 in the front. He could use some action. And moreover, he could use some Pokemon Refresh. Oh. You're practicing your gear tricks, from the looks of it. Jawbreaker 2. Let's go ahead and feed you some yellow Pokepuffs. Jawbreaker 2 might be with us for a good while, it depends. I don't know how long for sure Jawbreaker 2 will be with us, but he'll be with us for a good amount of time. I'll go ahead and rub your little earlobe thing. Yeah, there you go. Alright, get back in the ball. Alright. There's one more hotel on Akala Island, sir. I leave it up to your exquisite taste to judge which of the two offers the most delight. Me, I prefer the Tide Song Hotel. I interviewed for a job at that other place he never rejected. Hmm. Alright, time to visit the ranch next. I've just got to cut through Paniola Town. Car, car! Alright, well, let's see. Let's go ahead and talk to some people. No, I'm not. Time Song Hotel. Welcome to the Time Song Hotel. Oh, Matthew, I'm sorry. I saw some people who looked like those Team Skull Thugs and got scared. I was trying to avoid them, and then I think I ended up ended up. Then I think I ended up missing my meeting. Oh, but don't worry, it's fine. This is actually where I wanted to be. Will you be going for another one of your trials, Matthew? From what I read, I think that the nearest trial site must be the one up Route Four. Yep, Rotom Dex. Waiting was for two. Waiting for up to ten years. Oh my goodness. Right. Stop. Starmie. Oh man, I like Starmie. Starmie's Starmie's a really cool Pokemon. Alright. Route four. The path that leads to Paniola Town. I want to see if I can find a specific Pokemon here. I wasn't looking for you, but you're kinda cute. Z-Protect has the Z-Power effect resetting stats, Z-Harden is defensive. Let's go for a Breakneck Blitz, as long as I don't get flinched, of course. And Jawbreaker 2 activated his weak armor. Let's do this. It's Breakneck Blitz time. And it gets completely flattened by a critical hit. I'm not sure if the critical hit was necessary, but kind of cool that I got one. All right, you know what? I might as well put Calico up in the front. She could, she could definitely use some time in the limelight, I guess. There is a specific Pokemon I'm looking for here. But there is another opportunity at which we can get one as a gift. So, I don't know. We'll just wait and see for now. Drubbin! Nah, no thanks. Picky pack.
You know what? For now, I'm gonna go ahead and wait. To try and find what I'm looking for, because... Oh, Mudbray. Mudbray is a new Pokemon you can find here. It's pure ground type. Pretty pretty defensive and tanky. It has the ability Stamina, which raises its defense, its physical defense by one stage every time you hit it. So please, for the love of God, do not use, do not use multi-hit moves on Mudbray or Mudsdale. You got an Innkeeper, or Bellhop, I guess. I don't know. I feel like Innkeeper is easier to say. And also just more fun to say. Innkeeper, Innkeeper, Innkeeper. Pretty fun. Bite. Nom 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 nom. Calico grew to level 18. She is getting up there. Ernie grew to level 18. Jawbreaker 2 grew to level 14 and wants to learn Rock Blast. Yes, please. I'll go ahead and get rid of Sand Attack for Rock Blast. Alright, let's see. Even among the same species of Pokemon, individuals will have different strength. They may not seem too different at first, but as they grow, so too will their differences. We found a tiny mushroom at this rock. You know, these winding roots sometimes have secret little spots that are easy to overlook. Oh. A strange creature was sucked into the Zygarde cube. Xena wants to talk to you. I just received a signal from your Zygarde cube. The creature that just got sucked into the cube is what we call a Zygarde cell. The Zygarde cube I gave you is like a nest for cells and cores. Your mission is to collect all the cells and cores. We'll get in touch. Bon chance. I'm a collector, which is to say that I collect Pokemon. <laughs> collector Brian. And, well, there's a Munchlax, I guess. Um, I was looking for one of you before. for a defense curl, but I don't think that'll matter too much. Because I can just now go for a bite in order to finish you off. Bagon! I talked about you last time. I talked about you in one of the previous episodes. You're real rare. Oh, there's my stylus. Alright. Let's go ahead. You may remember Smasher, the Salamence from the last Let's Play. He started off as one of these wee little baby, baby dudes. And he grew into a terrifying Salamence. Gimme, gimme! No. No, you shall not have Calico. Found a revive. Found an adrenaline orb. This can be used in battle as a held item in order to in order to uh, raise your speed when you're intimidated. However, when used in battle as like an actual item, like a potion. Oh, hey, you have a Kanto Ratato. Pretty cool. I 
considering that there is the Alolum Rattata. Stanley grew to level 21, and he wants to learn to bind. Long bodies or tentacles used to bind, bind and squeeze the target for 4 to 5 turns. 85% accuracy, you know what? Nah. I don't feel like learning bind. Sightseer Scotty was taken down. Looking at a Pokemon summary page, you can change the arrangement of his moves by touching a move. time, everybody. I might have to just catch this Eevee. This is a female Eevee. I'm... I'm gonna catch this Eevee. Because... Da, 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 da. That's right. Eevee. Eevee here is my third permanent team member. Now, so long as Jawbreaker 2 doesn't knock out the Eevee with the headbutt... Which, thankfully, it doesn't. It's gonna call... it's gonna call in an ally. Which is just another Eevee. Rarely... and this is kind of funny... During the daytime, Eevee can rarely call in... an Espeon. Alright, well now I'm at minus two accuracy, and Rock Blast isn't accurate to begin with, so... Wait. Ernie has Keen Eye. I'm gonna go to Ernie in order to... take on this... ordeal. Alright, Ernie. Let's do it. Go for the Brick Break. Jawbreaker 2 grew to level 15. I'm gonna go ahead and catch you in a Heal Ball. I think that's kinda cutesy. One. Two. Another Eevee. Which I'm just gonna have to go ahead and break break. Hashimari grew to level 20. for another one. Go. This is the last heal ball I have, unfortunately, but, well, it is what it is. One, two, three. Hey, we got it! Alright. Welcome to the squad, Eevee. You are my third permanent team member. We've already seen Espeon. I'm gonna go ahead and give you a nickname of... Claire. And 
now Claire, I'm gonna go ahead and put in the party in place of Haymaker. Sorry, Haymaker, you weren't here long, but your servitude was not in vain. Welcome to the squad, Claire. Alright. Let's go ahead and clean off your earlobe. And also your foot. And you can go ahead and have... A yellow poke bean. Let's go ahead and check out Claire. I'll go ahead and give you some polka beans. Let's go ahead and keep patting you, cause you're, you're precious. You deserve the pets. Let's go ahead and max out your enjoyment. For the sake of maxing out your enjoyment. You're all maxed out on enjoyment. There you go. So, confession time. Again, I guess. First step to surpassing Captain Mao is to strengthen my Pokemon. So, for a long time, I have thought that I am going to use Espeon. As my evolution. However, I think I'm going to let one happen first. Whether or not I use whether or not I use Espeon or the other evolution that I'm thinking of using first, I'll leave it up to chance. One, two, three. Calico grew to level 19. Lost! I have lost to another. You can go ahead and make some neck patsies. Let's go ahead and heal up my Pokemon, Ernie. You go ahead and get healed. You get healed. You get healed. Oh yeah, I better go ahead and give Claire. Normally, MC. And. Let's see, is there anything? I'm gonna go ahead and give you Echoed Voice. And then I'm 
also going to go ahead and give you Protect. Because Protect is generally just a good move. Alright. Oh, something in the berries. It's a crab brawler. Alright, crab brawler. Get out of here, crab brawler. Oh no, I have to defeat it. Okay then. Shimari. It's your time to shine. Go for a disarming voice. And another one. After I get the berries, of course. Lumberry. A guava berry. A guava berry again. Mago berry. And another guava berry. Let's go ahead and check out Claire. Neutral nature. Not bad. Sturdy body, that means your best IV is defense, I think. I hope I'm right. Alright. Next time on Pokemon Sun, we're gonna go forward to Paniola Town and see just what it contains. See you next time.